Hey guys, Tommy here from Berry Kutsubishi. Today we're taking a look at this 2017 uh, Toyota Fortuna GXL um, 4x4 dual range in silver. Uh, silver Sky is what this uh, color is called. So yeah, 2017, um, this car has got a 6 speed automatic gearbox. Uh, it's a 4 cylinder, 2.8 litre turbo diesel. Um, these things are quite good, quite reliable being Toyota and stuff like that as well. Now, um, it has got a 5 star NCAP rating and it's got an 8.6 litres per 100 Ks and that is uh, combined fuel consumption. So overall, really, really nice guys. Um, a lot of features on this, it's got reverse camera, bull bar, LED light bar, rhino roof racks, um, really great service history, hill descent controls, low range gearbox, tow bar, and it's got a 2.8 ton towing capacity as well. So overall, really, really good all round all -round car. Um, what we'll do is we'll, do, we'll go for a quick walk around, I'll show you the ins and outs of the car, and then hopefully we can get you guys in to come and have a look. First of all, we'll just start off with this pie just here. No marks, no gutter rash on it at all. Um, really good tread on those tires as well. Moving our way down to the front of the car, you've got your um, genuine Toyota bull bar on there, which looks really, really good. Um, adds a lot of character to the car as well. You do get your indicators, your daytime running lights, LED light bar as well, all working really, really well. Some really nice headlights there too. You've got your grill behind the, the lights there and then so forth just on this side too. Bonnet's in really good condition too. No paint swirls, nothing like that. So paint condition's in really good condition too. This is the bull bar looks from the side. And then you've got your other wheel just there. Same story, uh, good tread on those tires and no gutter rash, no marks on the wheel. And we've got the side of the car, so you've got your side uh, mirrors with your indicators on them too. Got your Rhino roof racks just up the top there. Side steps are standard on these ones in black, which look good. Um, you've got your chrome handles with your keyless entry button as well. Now this has got keyless start too. Um, car, car has got a mild privacy glass on it. Would always recommend getting tint so we can tint the front windows and fix up the back as well for you guys. Um, which will make the car look really good. And we've got the back of the car here too. Good condition on that one. Our diesel cap is on our passenger side and these ones. Moving down to the back of the car. Oh, that light's a bit, a bit irritating. Um, Alright, so you've got your Fortuna logo just across there. Your reverse camera is just underneath, just here. Um, all your back sensors and stuff there, your tow bar setup is all all here as well. So overall really really nice. And there's the back of the car. <coughs> Sorry. And then we've got our last wheel just here. Overall really good conditions. I haven't seen any marks or scratches or anything like that. Um, which I would point out if we did have them on there. Side steps on this side as well guys. Um, indicators in your mirrors. Overall really really nice. Let's have a quick look at the inside. Alright, so on this one you do have cloth seats. All the way through these ones. You don't get powered seats in this, um, unfortunately, but sort of make do with what you've got. Besides that, car's packed full of features. Um, these are your doors as well. Mirror, uh, your windows and mirror settings are all there too. You've got your speaker just down here as well. Um, let's quickly jump in. Okay. So over here we have got our, our keyless start and stop, basically just there. Um, I'll open the door again quickly. So over here we've got our driving lights, which are all set up just there. You've got your um, parking sensors, your idle up as well. Um, and then down here you've also got your fuel and bonnet release. Which is really nice. You've also got your center cluster just there guys. So you've got your rev gauge. 
on that side your speeder on the other side and then you do have the digital screen in the center as I close this I should change the settings and then you can flick through the different settings you have on the steering wheel so you can sort of flick through go through all the settings that you want to and basically go from there guys so really really nice um, over here you've got your multi-functioning steering wheel so I can block that sun uh, so over here you've got all your volume and stuff like that too Um, volume here, controls are all here, this is all your Bluetooth stuff just there. Um, you've got your cruise control down here, like all Toyotas do, just sitting there. And then these buttons here will control the screen just there, guys. Sorry about the sun, I might park somewhere else on the next video. Um, now over here you've got your touch screen, so you've got Bluetooth, um, AM, FM radio as well. Um... All your air conditioning settings are all there too. You've got your um, traction control, your rear diff lock, your four-wheel drive modes are all just there. Got some cup holders here too. Your gear stick, park to drive, your power mode and eco mode. A little bit more storage. Um, and you've just got the rest of the seats just there, guys. Let's have a look at the back. Really nice seats in the rear as well. Um, no stains, no marks, nothing like that on the car at all. Um, really good seating. A little bit of storage in the back of the console there. And you've got some storage in the back of the seats as well. Alrighty, now I've got the back just here, guys. And with the Fortuners, just like the old Prados, the seats do fling up sideways. We do have a rubber mat here, you can take that out and then drop these down. And then you do have a seven-seater as well. I do have the tow bar just sitting there, um, which does go in here. Um, yeah, overall, guys, really, really good condition. Everything seems to be in working order. Um, drives really nice, I did take it for a quick spin as well. Um, but yeah, you won't be disappointed in this car. Definitely come down and have a look, have a drive. Um, more the other side of the seats just here then over here we have got our passenger seat we've got the service books there car's got really good service history um you've got some rubber mats too so there you guys best thing to do is come down and have a visit our address is 20 to 32 kangan drive in berwick that's 20 to 32 kangan drive in berwick Ask for myself, Tommy, or any of our other salesmen. We're more than happy to help you guys out where we can. Speak to our business managers about getting some finance too. Um, and speak to our pre-delivery manager for all your aftermarket needs. We can do um, paint protection, so your hydro protection, interior, exterior. Uh, we do tinting, we do uh, dash cams, and we do extended warranties as well. So definitely come down and have a look, have a chat to us. Let's see what the best deal we can work out for you guys, and you, you'll definitely be happy. See you guys, speak to you guys soon, and hopefully we can get you down here. Bye.